Alright, we're running for it. We're running for it. We're running for it. No! Get out of the way! Okay. Hello, my fellow nice. I hope you're having an amazing day, and welcome back to a new video. Now, today we are in Alpha 3 for our Hell and Neighbor Challenges series. We finally have another version of the game in our series of Hell and Neighbor Challenges. It only, it only took about three years. Well, over three years. So, the two challenges I have are don't get caught, while, and you can't hide. So basically you just have to beat the game, you can't get caught by the neighbor or hide. So if he's chasing me, I can't just go into a wardrobe or hide under his bed. And the second challenge, which is a fan requested one, is to do the decorating house challenge in Alpha 3. I was originally going to do four items only for this version, but that's not even possible. So I, I, I decided, let's do the fan requested one. I got that comment on my Hello Neighbor Alpha 3 map ex exploration video. Hard to believe that came out about three years ago already. <laughs> yeah, really? Can you not be stupid? We, yeah, we have to uh, just beat this version of the game without getting caught, and we can't hide in the uh, wardrobes or anything. <gasps> oh no. Oh, I got stuck in a bear trap. I thought I was screwed. <laughs> oh, where is he? Where is he? I don't know where he's at. We set that bear trap again. I don't like that. <laughs> All right, we're doing good so far. I I, I, I gotta stop saying that because I end up jinxing myself every damn time. Where's the chair at? There we go. I'll open that up. Let's open this up. Oh. I'm gonna try breaking this window here. There we go. It gets in down there, away from the front of the house. Now I just gotta get the crowbar. Let's go. Oh, oh yes. A few moments later. I didn't even grab the key card. Oh my gosh. No. Oh, this is terrible. I was so focused on getting the damn crowbar, I didn't even get the key card I need. Run. 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 Oh. 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 That was so close. If he sees us, that's fine. We just can't get caught by him. Oh, hi. Hi. No, no, no. I don't know where he's at, but honestly, I'm gonna make a break for it. I'm running for it. I'm running for it. I'm running for it. I am allowed to do this. Oh, there he is in his kitchen. Really? I don't trust him if he's there. I know this sounds crazy, but I'm gonna get him unstuck. Come on. <laughs> I hit him in the butt with it. Oh. <gasps> No! No, 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 no. Oh, Bruh. what? No, I have to restart. That was a load of fucking crap. I know he could jump in this version, but that is just straight up bullshit. I am calling bullshit on that. Let's try to play a little bit smarter this time and not forget the fucking key card. Can you get out of the way, boxes? I'm gonna use that one to break that window, and then I'll run up to the front of the house to get him up there by breaking this window again. There we go. That's my usual strat for this. Alright, well good to know that you are not 100% guaranteed safe on this damn light. That was, oh, that was so, that pissed me off. Got over here again. Let's destroy that, because I don't like him. And then I will jump right over here. Why'd you have to do that? <laughs> Why'd you have to do that, Naves? Just why? Why, 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 why? Alright, let's go. And let's not forget the damn key card this time. Oh. I don't know if you guys can hear it. I might have the audio for the game turned out a little too low. But I just heard a door open right below me. I just heard it again. I don't like it. I don't like that one bit. I'm gonna go back to, to this room right here. From this hallway. I wanna toss this broom down here and break this window. There we go. That'll get him back towards that way. <gasps> <gasps> no! Oh no! And now he's chasing me. How did I blow that? I need to know where he's at, because I'm not running in there blindly like an idiot. Come on. Come on. Come on out, Naves. You know you want to. Why is there golden apple painting in here? That's where. Where is he? Oh, hi. There you are. I know you're going to be coming around there. Are you stuck again? He got stuck somewhere again, didn't he? Oh my god! What is this? 
Oh, hi. Can you please go and stuck for me? Why am I stuffed up? Damn it. I had a cold a couple weeks ago, and that should be gone by now. All right, there we go. He is unstuck, which means we can finally make progress again. Can you please just, you know, maybe hurry on up a bit? I would greatly appreciate that. Oh, oh, hi, oh, hi, hi. Okay, nope, 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 you are not catching me. Why would you, why would you do that? How'd you throw a glar, a glar? How'd you throw a glar? Uh, I said it again! How did you throw a, a jar of glue from there to here? That is bullshit. Let's watch him. Where are you going? Can you not do that? What? Look what happened to the damn door! <laughs> Alpha 3 is so buggy, he can't even place a bear trap down without it breaking the whole fucking door. Can he not even get through it? Are you serious? Are you actually serious? I would sneak around, but I can guarantee you he's just gonna chase right after me. Hi. Yeah, I did just hit him in the face with the garbage can, so... Yeah, there's that. Is he gonna be stuck there forever now, though? If so, what do I do? I'll have to, like, run around or something. Yeah, he can't walk through the damn door now. Are you serious? Can I sneak around this way? Or is he gonna notice? He's gonna notice! Of course! This cycle is just going to continue repeating. So I'm going to run around this way. I have a chair in hand so that way I can fend him off. As long as I don't run into shit. I don't have the key card. Or I, I don't have the crowbar. Oh no. So focused on that damn door. He's probably going to get stuck there. But as soon as he sees me, he's probably going to find another way around it. Like jumping through a window or something. So I'm going to have to jump out that window and just make a break for my house, aren't I? <laughs> oh no. Alright. There we go. Actually made it this time. Jump. Okay. Throw that. Get the key or get the crowbar. Let's get out of here. Please jump out the window. Let's just get out of here. Go. No, no, no. Oh, if he hit me there, I would have just fallen like a rock, and he would have caught me because he is quick. All right. Well, he just got stuck again. So I'm just gonna run this way. All right, well, that was a bit of a delayed reaction. <laughs> Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. We have to do this ASAP. 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 No. Get in there. Yes. I made it. Oh. <laughs> and for good strokes, let's just, uh... Let's break all these windows. Why? Because I'm a douchebag. No, I'm not. I'm not a douchebag. In the game, I am, but... All right. I was hoping I could pick up the box to break that last window, but that doesn't matter. Woo! We beat the game <laughs> without getting caught. That's almost unheard of in this version. And I've actually managed to beat this game unintentionally, or this version of the game unintentionally, without even getting seen. But that is a challenge for another day, because that is... Oh, man, that challenge is absurdly hard. <laughs> Alright, moving on to the next challenge. Alright, the next challenge is the decorating house challenge. This is what was requested by the viewer. And as you can see, we have a house. But that's really about all there is to describe it. Other than the fact that it is, it's absurdly dark like the rest of Alpha 3. <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying, we're going to start decorating our house like how we did in Alpha 2. We're going to immediately start off by breaking our glue jar. Fantastic. So we have all this stuff here. So we're going we're gonna to move it in. But we're also going to be stealing stuff from that house there. That's where all the goodies are at. So that's what we're that's what we're going to be doing. <laughs> We've got our broom. Now we're just going to move all this other stuff in. The binoculars can go in here. Boom. The apple can go right there. That way we have a little tree to munch on when we're on the phone. Frying pan can go there for now. And it's hard to see a damn thing over here. I'm going to set this table down. What we're going to do is we're going to make a little dining area over there once I can actually see shit. <laughs> Because I'm going to be stealing the lights from his house. And while our boxes are disappearing, that's just wonderful. Sure, I'll put it over here so that way we can put it next to the table when we're done. Um, we can put the shoe right there. I'll take this box, put it right there. I'd appreciate if you wouldn't kick it. There we go. I'll set this alarm clock on top of those boxes whenever I get them all. We're going to have to imagine a little... Uh, nightstand dresser here made out of boxes 
Please don't glitch out. There we go. The physics and the disappearing glitch are terrible in this version. So, there we go. All of our stuff's moving, partially because half of it disappeared. But let's get to stealing stuff. Naves, you have three trash cans. One man does not need three trash cans. Even if this house is this big, half of it's like abandoned. So we're going to steal your garbage cans. Let's put them right here. Place on there. I want you to place the lid on the trash can, not like... There we go. That's pretty good right there. Take that. Not as good as it could be. There we go. Pretty good. We're not going to steal those garbage. I mean, come on. What... What kind of neighbors would we be if we did that? i uh, take his lawnmower and watering can. He's clearly not using either of them, so I don't think he'll miss them. Watering can can go right here. The lawnmower, we can set it right here. We can actually use it to mow our lawn because he is clearly not using it for his lawn. First things first, I am stealing this damn lamp. Now I can't actually see anything. What the heck? Let's turn this on. Now it's probably going to get his attention. Where's the shoes? Actually, I don't, I don't need his shoes. I'll take the hat and the plant. There's also a hat rack here I'll take. Alright, we're setting ourselves up. Hat rack can go right there. Um, the hat can go on the hat rack. Right there. It's on the hat rack. Yay! It's on the hat rack. Let's go put the lamp over here. And I can still barely see shit. Damn it! Alright, let's try to make out the illumination. Oh. He's noticing something is up. <laughs> I knew it was about time. <laughs> uh, where can I put this? I'll set that right there. Actually, I'll set it right here in the middle of the floor until we can find a good place for it. What the hell, man? <laughs> I thought for a second there, he was going to straight up run across the street and get me. <laughs> but this cannot stand. No! Oh, it actually kind of startled me. I didn't expect him to be that quick. <laughs> Well, there's that. I kind of threw it in his face. Really? No. You know what? Eat it. Suck a camera. This is going to be kind of a pain, isn't it? Because for some reason, all he does is just hang out in this damn corridor right here. Yes, Nabes. There's the camera on the ground right there. Don't give me that look. Let's wait. Let's wait. All right. <laughs> Alright, I already have a frying pan, so let's steal his toaster. Um, you know what, let's steal the clean dishes. Let's not steal the dirty dishes. And we'll take a kettle. Oh, never mind, our inventory's full. This is the perfect chance, though. This is the perfect chance to steal, to steal his stuff. I'm just going to set everything down here, and then we can organize it and make it look good later. I'll put some distance between the, other, the items so that way they don't just start disappearing, you know, when I try to pick them up. Steal the cups. Oh god, I hear him coming. Here I'm coming. I need a flashlight. There's just no other way around it. All right, let's steal just one book because our inventory is full. All right, we're running for it. We're running for it. We're running for it. No, Galloway. Okay. Since our glue jar wanted to, you know, get smashed into a thousand pieces, we can stick the book in there instead. Um, uh, let's place this closer to the table so I can see it. There we go. I can put this cup on the table. I can also put a plate on the table. See, we're, we're good. We're good at this. I'm good at this. I'm gonna have to get a makeshift kitchen for this. AKA just a ton of boxes. And the neighbor has a ton of boxes. I mean, look at this. He has boxes here. He has boxes here. He has boxes here. He has boxes here. He has a shit ton in the house. He's just got boxes everywhere. So he's not gonna miss a few. What the hell? More of him disappeared. Are you serious? Well, I mean, at least he has box insurance, so he has that going for him. One, two. Okay, we'll stack them too high. They don't have to be perfect, because otherwise they'll explode. There we go. That's the start of our makeshift kitchen. Also, for some reason, I find it funny how when we're standing here, we can see the boxes, but when we get closer to them, then we can't see them. What the hell? <laughs> That's so weird. What? No! Are you serious? What? See, this is what I mean. This is why I hate the physics in this version. We can kind of recover from it. It won't be pretty. There we go. Oh, all right. All right. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. There we go. 
All right, here's our box kitchen. It's not perfect, but we can make it work. So I'll start off by grabbing the toaster. How does this thing place? Uh, okay. Maybe we can place it over here. No, don't, don't get messed up. There we go, kind of hanging off the counter, just, just a teensy bit. But there we go, we have a toaster. We can make some toast now. Let's also put the dishes down. Let's put them right here. Plates can go right there, and our cups can go on top of this box. All right, we're making progress. No, why? Can you just not? Like, can you not? Okay, I thought I could pull a fast one on him, but no. I couldn't even get into the wardrobe there. Damn it! No, why? Just why? Hmm. I'll take the vase. I'll take the vase. I'll take the vase. I don't even care. I stole your vase, dude. We can put the vase right here. There we go. That's nice. Uh, this chair, we can put it right here. Perfect. Oh. Okay. Right, we're in, guys. We are in. Right, let's turn the light on in here so that way we can actually see stuff. All right, let's steal a bucket. Hmm. Steal his TV. We'll need that. And we'll steal his TV remote. How about that? <laughs> there we go. Making off like a bandit. I'm gonna need to set this TV on something. For now, I can go right there. Um, TV remote can go right there. We can move this frying pan over here with the dishes. There we go. Oh, shoot. Where's it going? I don't know. What the motherfucker? Are you just, are you kidding me? All right, let me steal some books since I'm in here. Oh, I forgot to put the bucket back. What the hell is this red box? I bet that has something to do with this AI. Oh, hi, 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 hi. I'll stick that there. Armchair I can put right here. That's a perfect spot for it. Now we'll, we'll get some use out of this thing. I'm getting music like he's outside, so I'm gonna run in there. Oh, you clever bastard. Uh. Are you fucking kidding me? Why? Why are you putting buckets on all the damn doors? And why that camera have to have such a long range? I'll take some books. Yeah, if that seems about right. Um, what is this? Is this a book too? Yep, that's a book too. Uh oh. Uh oh. Run, 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 run. Oh wait, shit! I can't get through that way because it's locked. Oh no. Oh, eat book. Run, there's weird demon screaming. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> no, 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 no. Where is he? I have another chair, dude. I'm not afraid to use it. He lost me. Oh, well. I'll just... I'll take this chair and I'll chuck it through his front window. Or just out of his house. Okay, that works. <laughs> book. Book. What the... How did it go through the back of the cabinet? Come on, place it in there. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Get in there. All right, there you go. Now get in there as well, Blue Book. Hey, we did it! <laughs> Sneak in. Let's run! Okay, bye! <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go, let's go. I don't even care. I don't even care if he sees me. I don't even care. Let's run for it. Get onto the second floor. Get onto the second floor. Get onto the second floor. Oh! Oh! Sucker! <laughs> Let's take this lamp, because we definitely need some lights for our house. Um, let's take a clock, too. That could do, that could work. I don't want a creepy eye painting, that's just, no. And I definitely don't want an up-close of the neighbor's mouth screaming with his tongue sticking out. But we'll take the daisy painting, that seems like the nicest painting out of the bunch. Do I have an inventory slot? No, okay, I'll come back and get the blue lamp. Alright, let's go, where is this guy? Where is he? I have no idea, but let's go. Alright, let's set this lamp in the corner here. Perfect, that's lovely. I'll set this in here on this. Slightly crooked, but it works. Painting. Can't really hang stuff on the walls, which is a shame. So, would you not fall over? I chose you for a reason. Why? Come on. Come on, really? Oh, uh, come on. Why are you so stupid? Anything we can set it on? Good enough. <laughs> well, he's in here somewhere. For some reason, this camera's not sparking, but it's off. That's weird. 
We'll take a tea kettle. We could use that. Anything in there? No? Okay. We'll take a couple more plates. We could use those. We could take another plant. Oh, never mind. Our inventory is full. Plate. <laughs> the leaning tower of plates. That works by me. <laughs> um, we'll take this plate. Don't fall. Alright. It's wobbling, but it's good. I don't know where this guy is. He's still chasing me. Let's take that. I'll take a couple boxes so we can set our TV on. I don't know where this guy is. He's still chasing me. The chase music's still going. I just don't know where he's at. We can take our uh, mannequin. Just set it in our bedroom for... For some company would you not do that please thank you very much there we go perfect well the screen's a bit staticky but oh well works for me where is this guy son of a all right well let's take that because that we could actually use that for defending our own house from any other neighbors to try to you know sneak on in and might steal our stuff where can the bear trap go oh i know we can go at the top can i please be able to see stuff you can go right at the top of the stairs here. There. I wish we had I wish we had some attic rooms and whatnot. And they already kind of exist, but you can't actually get to them, so Yeah, bummer there. Oh, we need the the uh, TV antenna. That might fix the static problem. Um uh, we already have a pair of, a pair of uh, binoculars. Let's run in here. What's in here? Oh hi. Don't mind me. I'll take this, I'll take his gigantic ass mug, and let's just go. Alright, we've got another dishes delivery. I'll put the mug right there. TV antenna, we'll put right on top of there. Does that work? Nope, it's too good to be true. These things are so lopsided that they don't even place on top of each other correctly. Oh my god. I'm sorry, but I just gotta rag on the new art style every single chance I get. I mean, come on, it sucks. You know, we'll take the second TV. Yeah, that, that seems about right. We'll take this chair. We'll put it in our bedroom. Got some apples and a flashlight. Let's see what upstairs has to offer. Here's this blue lamp. Let's get that. And our inventory is full again. All right, back down the stairs we go. Let's put this blue lamp in the bathroom. Cause that, that's just honestly relaxing. Let's get this TV out of our face. I'll put it right there. We'll get some boxes for it. I'll put this chair right here next to the mannequin. That way, we'll put it right next to the mannequin. That way if the mannequin's legs or peg gets uh, tired, it can just sit down and rest itself. This might be an issue. This is the only door that's accessible because these other three are locked without the key and whatnot. Hmm, is there anything in there we could steal? Or that would be worth stealing? Got some chairs. I mean, we got the toy rifle in there. So maybe it'll, it'll be worth going for. What the? No, son of a bitch. Let's break that. <laughs> Back the gun. Where are you? We're coming for you. Come on. There we go. Now, let's get upstairs and let's get that blue key so that way we can access more of the house. I mean, in a way it is helpful the neighbor got stuck. I just wish the chase music wouldn't play over and over again. Because it is getting kind of old hearing it over and over again. Let's take this lamp. I'll throw that at that because I'm petty. And I'll take this, and I'll also throw it at that because I'm petty and I failed to break the first time. You know what? You have something to do too. There you go. I mean, there's no point in getting the key card while we're here because I'm not even intending to beat the game. I have an idea. I'll turn the gate and we'll get that toy gun after I uh, empty my pockets back at the house. I'm going to put this lamp right here. This way it lightens up the front entrance. We actually don't need the magnet gun, so I'll just set it right here. Hey, it's kind of floating, but that's fine. I can't believe the neighbor's still stuck in there. That's just craziness. But actually, if you use a switch and make a beeline for it, what you can do is get into that toy rifle room. Can we make it? Can we make it? Yes. Yes, we made it. There you go. Yeah, if you have the gold key, you can unlock this door, do that trick, and get in there without even having to do that annoying blue key jump. I'll just break that because I feel like being an ass. If I've got the toy rifle, now where should we go? You know what? Yeah, we will take some shoes just because he has too many pairs in this house already. Who knows? Maybe they're designer shoes and we can sell them for a quick buck later on. The toy rifle, I'll put, um, let's not put it next to the mannequin because I don't want the mannequin getting ideas. We can put it right up here 
Oh, if we if I can see shit, we'll put it right up here with the bear trap. You two can be friends or something. That's what that'll be my little armory up there. You know what? I'm gonna get some gallons of milk. There we go. Well, cartons of milk. We might want to drink them pretty promptly, because I don't want to be drinking spoiled milk. H have you guys ever tasted spoiled milk? Oh, it is terrible. And not like, oh, it's spoiled to the point where it's chalky spoiled. Just like, just spoiled in general. Ugh. I remember one time I tasted it, and the milk hadn't even hit the sell-by date yet, and it wasn't even close to it. Oh, that was nasty. You know what? The mannequin can have a friend. I'll bring you. You can come along, too. You, down here. Demon screaming mannequin, you can come along too. Yeah, I'll put the mannequins in here and they can hang out with each other. I have a, there's a couple more in the house. But, um, yeah, this totally isn't weird. Do I want them in here? Son of a bitch. You know what, yeah, they can stay in here. They can stay out of the neighbor's house. But if they try anything, they can kiss their ass goodbye and they can go into the landfill. We have a couple more mannequins upstairs to get. We have one right up there. Somewhere, if I, I don't think we can see it from where we're at. Alright, hopefully this will work. Throw it right there. Didn't work and I just realized we gotta break this window if we want any chance of getting through there. There we go. Come on. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? No, you know what? Fuck it, you can get out of here. Let's throw his TV at it. How about that? If I can actually... Stop glitching out! Alright, there we go. That didn't work. You know what? Let's just try a box. That'll be best. One. Yes, okay. Let's make the jump. What was that? That was such a weak, limp ass jump. Can we get on this shelf? I'm just curious. Can we get on here? Can we get on here? Oh, come on. And there we go. Alright, come on. What the hell? Oh, that's the shadow. I thought the. I thought the. What the hell? Why is the shadow above the platform? Oh, that's weird. For a second, I thought. The damn platform just duplicated itself. Come on. Go. Yes, okay. There is one thing though. The last mannequin is in a room that we can't actually access legitimately. Could we get it through here? Could, like, could we jump through there and would it lead to that room that we can't get to? I don't know. Instead of trying to make that jump again, I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna get a box from behind this door and we'll try to go over there. Yeah, I don't know why all this stuff is here. Oh no, what did I just do? Um, It exploded. I picked something up and it just exploded on me. That's a first. Alright, let's try to go over here. Perfect. Jump! I didn't even fucking jump. Are you kidding me? I pressed the damn space bar and I didn't jump. What is this shit? I can't believe I'm doing this all to get a mannequin that I might not even be able to get. <laughs> I mean, I want all the mannequins to be united, so... I mean, come on. Just cut me some slack here. Come on. Yes, there we go. Yes, we can get it. Okay. Woo! I think that's all of them, right? Yeah, because there's none on that platform up there. I can't think of where any other mannequins could be. I just can't think of any. Watch me watch this back and be like, oh wait, there was a mannequin in that spot and then I just missed it. Alright, let's put you all in a little nice circle. I'll get this guy. Ah, uh, I hope the TV has insurance or else it just got destroyed. Oh, no, 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 no. We're having the lights on. Don't have to take turns sharing the chair. I really hope this doesn't look like something cult related. I <laughs> this is just, oh no. <laughs> Let me take this. I'll put the box in, on the floor. Now we can set our TV down. Right there. I'll take this. Boom. Our, our room is a bit cramped because of the the uh, mannequin gang, but hey, at least we have all we have the entire uh, friend group here. No, we need we need some other forms of entertainment besides TV. And since computers don't exist in this game, probably because this version takes place in the 60s. At least I'm thinking. We need something else to entertain ourselves. Question. Does the Hell of Neighbor Alpha 3 take place in the 60s or the 90s? Because I know Alpha 4 and onwards takes place in the 90s. But I don't know about Alpha 3. I know Alpha 2 and before takes place in the 60s. But what about Alpha 3? Does anybody know? Answer that question down below if you know. I'll give them, I'll give them some paper airplanes to share. Unfortunately, I don't have enough for each of them. But that'll, that'll be good. 
This video is probably just going to make me look like I'm just slowly losing my mind. And who knows, maybe I am, or maybe I'm not, who knows. There's nothing we can get from up there. Yeah, it's just blocked off with furniture. These paintings here, I can't even grab. So, maybe I could grab some other paintings. We can get this for our kitchen. You know what, I have an idea. This isn't totally, this is totally not going to seem creepy. We can get some of these uh, family pictures, and we can put them in the bedroom, because the entire family's there. The entire mannequin family. I am losing my goddamn mind, aren't I? <laughs> we can put these right here. Might not be able to see them. Come on, don't do that, really? Stay up. Stay up. Oh, come on. Let's throw them towards the wall. You know what? We can... That, that works. I'm not fighting with them. Hey, there we go. We finally got one to work with us. Best way to finish this off is to get the uh, crowbar. We need a tool, because you never know when you might need that tool. You know, it's just a basic necessity tool. We're not going to worry about unlocking the basement door. We're just going to steal the crowbar. And, uh, yeah, that'll be the end of this challenge. Because I honestly don't have anything else left to steal, to be truthful with you. Let's just break that. We can steal this lamp. We got another lamp. Come on. Alright, there we go. Let's jump and we're good to go. This crowbar can go in our armory, you know, just, just just for precautions. You might need to use it as a weapon. You never know in case knaves might try to come back in and steal all this stuff. All right, let's take that. Pretty, very pretty indeed. Yeah, this bathtub is pulling a pre-op on us and it's just randomly out in the middle of the floor. But, oh well. Also, we don't even have a toilet. So if we need to go, you know, do our business, we'll probably have to go out in the backyard or something. I mean, we can steal a few more plates, but I know I said earlier I wouldn't steal the dirty dishes, but we'll steal the dirty dishes. <laughs> yeah, I really don't have anything else left to steal, and I'm not going to try to push my... Am I going to push my luck? Yes, I'm going to push my luck. There's one. There's two. Shit, I didn't mean to put that back there. Can I grab the flashlight again? I don't know how the physics are working on that, but we all know Alpha 3 physics, so it doesn't really surprise me. <laughs> yeah, I really don't have anything else left to steal. So I, I think I'm going to call it here. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next part when I do this, which I don't know when it'll be. But let's say goodbye to the neighbor. Hi. Bye. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Alright, that's two more challenges done. Boom, and boom.